After the events of the last 12 months, it's remarkable that Whitehaven are playing at all. So it was pretty encouraging that they played so well against Rochdale yesterday. Well, at least they did for half the game. The home side were in sparkling form for the first 40 minutes of 2011's Championship 1 campaign. Scott McAvoy, Chris Smith and Craig Calvert among the scorers as they turned round with an 18-point lead. But beware the Rochdale Hornets who specialise in stinging you in the tail. Last week they turned the tables on Workington with a second-half fight back in the Challenge Cup and they set about doing the same at the recreation ground. Within a few minutes they'd crossed the line for their first try. No need to worry at that stage, especially as Haven then went and scored the most spectacular try of the match. Carl Seiss made the initial break and Lewis Palfrey completed a lightning raid from one end of the pitch to the other. Back came Rochdale though, with two more tries. Winger Andy Saywell was on his way to a hat-trick. So relief all round when Howard Hill piled through a gap to put the result beyond all reasonable doubt. Haven are of course still bottom of the table, but minus six points sounds a lot better than minus nine.